Kia ora, we're down here at the uh, New Zealand Barbarians team training and with me is Te Toirua Tahuri Orangi. Kia ora, bro. Kia ora, bro. Oh, thanks. Good, th good thank you. Yeah. Hey, look, um, we saw the team's only uh, assembled uh, this week. How's the preparations be going ahead of the game on Saturday against the Māori All Blacks? Yeah, given only a week, I think the boys just trying to get that unity. I think that's what's going to help us win the game. So, yeah, just pretty much uh, as much as um, time with each other. So like just getting out of our out of our um, rooms and interacting, socialising, yeah, pretty much that. I would have watched the Māori All Black game against uh, Fiji on the weekend. What, what did you think of their performance? I think they've done pretty good, knowing that they only had like a little little time together. But yeah, I guess uh, the Fijis came out came out firing, and um, yeah, they're unlucky to win. Yeah. Can you take a lot away from their performance, or you know, when you're preparing to, to come up against the team, you, you look at their last performance. Is it something that's kind of been talked about this week? Yeah, yeah. both sides like um, we watch how they play, and we try and take what Fiji had done to them. So yeah, we're pretty much trying to incorporate Fiji kind of kind of style into our Barbas kind of style. Yeah, there's a bit of a, a mixture in the um, side. Uh, there's a couple of senior players as well. There's Corey Jane, uh, obviously, um, who's played uh, for the All Blacks. He's had a successful career. You've been just broken term at all about, um, I guess, the experience. Yeah, yeah, we had a bit of a team bond last night, so yeah, had a quick yarn to him and um, see what, see what he, um, what his experience was like and all that kind of stuff. So yeah, pretty, pretty cool guy too, chilling ass, humble, just yeah, easy to talk to. You got a couple of mates in the Māori All Blacks as well. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It'd be an interesting one playing against him. Definitely, uh, I know a couple of the boys, Otteri Black and Shaw Winley, so I told them that, boys, watch out, watch out, we're coming, the Barbas are coming. <laughs> What's it mean to play against the Māori All Blacks team? Oh, Pretty funny, yeah, like just knowing a couple of the players, so they yeah, just get stuck into it. It's going to be a massive game. I guess the barbars kind of style is here, just have a little bit of fun, so yeah, try and bring that to the to the game. You would have experienced uh, performing in the haka uh, for many years when you were at high school, uh, but to be standing there in front of the Māori, Māori All Blacks when they perform the haka, what do you think that experience is going to be like? I think a couple of the boys are going to do the haka back to them, so yeah, really? just ex expect the back end. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. Well, I wish you all the best. Cheers, mate. We're going to talk now to uh, your higher west. Kia ora, Look, um, you were part of the Māori All Blacks last year. What does it mean to play against them this year? Yeah, I don't know. Uh, obviously, I was pretty disappointed to miss out on the, the Māoris this year, but to get a chance to, to be in the Bahrains is pretty um, pretty cool, and it's a pretty special team, and um, we've been in camp for a couple of days and really enjoying, enjoying it as well. What's the feeling like coming into the camp? You've got a mixture of players from across the country. Yeah, and got a, um, most of the boys are in different situations, like some of the boys are pushing for um, all black spots and um, things like that. So, you know, we're all um, come together nicely over the last couple of days and we're all um, looking forward to getting out there on Saturday night. You believe uh, you've got enough time to gel together as a unit and as a team, given you're only probably going to be together for four or five days? Yeah, obviously it's pretty tough not um, having a lot of time together, but you know, the couple of days we've had, um, we've got a whole lot of information on board and um, Training was looking pretty sharp with boys were in the right position, so um, yeah, hopefully it's enough time to put put together a good performance on uh, Saturday. You feel that because um, you were part of the Model Black outfit last year, you, you kind of have an advantage. You kind of know the style that they're going to be bringing come Saturday night. It might be something that you can kinda, you guys can kind of talk talk about and put out there on the field. Yeah, maybe. Um, but as you know, with Maldi rugby, it's sort of off the cuff sort of stuff, so you don't really know what they're going to throw at you. But um, yeah. Obviously, being there the last couple of years, no sort of the structures that they run, but yeah, come Saturday, it's sort of just what you see, I think, and um, uh, should be a pretty exciting game. Word is that you guys are going to perform a hucker when they perform a hucker. <laughs> I don't know about that. I think our team man's going to do one on by himself, I think. <laughs> I wish you all the best. Sweet. Cheers, brother. Kill it, bro. Brad Shields. Uh, we're good. How's things? Not too bad, sir. Yeah, no, no. Good, good. Preparations this week, you would have seen the performance uh, Māori All Blacks against Fiji on the weekend. I guess is there any way you can kind of explore a little bit uh, to look for their weaknesses? Oh, they, you know, they, they weren't, I don't think they're up to, up to their standards last week or against the Fijians and I think they're going to come out a, a whole different beast this week. You know, they had another extra week together so it's going to be tough. I just think um, we need to take their forwards front on and, and, and kind of play the bar by way. You know, some, maybe some individual magic might um, help uh, explore some of their weaknesses. You've got a good mixture of uh, players from across the country in, in, in your forward pack. Um, 
it's going to be quite interesting to see how you guys gel this weekend. Yeah, well, we talked about that. Um, one of the main things about this week is trying to get, in, get to know each other a bit better. And, um, you know, with that comes trust on the field and, and then get, can throw those little passes or you can you can do different things on the field, you know. And that, that's what we build during the week and, and that's what this uh, team's about. Is it a situation where you kind of focus more on the basics as opposed to trying to uh, do a bit more than usual? Oh, 100%. You know, we're all super rugby players, so we've got the skill and we've got the ability. It's just um, getting a basic structure and, and some, as you say, basic skills to, to get us through Saturday and everything. Everything else just comes with what we, what we know and what we're good at. There's a lot of players in here also playing for spots, potential spots to be caught up to the All Blacks at some point. Uh, you've uh, been in that environment before. Uh, what's that experience been like? Oh, it's awesome. You know, it's it's one that you don't forget. Um, and just to be a part of it, it just grows your game there a little bit more and gives you a little, bit, a little bit more insight to what's needed to get to the next level. And, and you're right, the opportunity on Saturday is, is huge for some boys. And, and if we can take that and, um, and play some good footy, then you never know what door opens up. The public's going to be a little divided actually on Saturday. Uh, hopefully there's a, a good balance of uh, fans cheering for both sides. But one of the most interesting things I guess is to, to play against the Māori All Blacks but to see them perform the haka. Yeah, well I was saying this week, you know, I've never been in a team that's faced the haka before, I've always been doing it. So uh, it'll be interesting and uh, something different for us but it's about how we're going to embrace that emotion and, um, and nullify that.